Hey guys, so I'm not sure if you saw this, but ConvertKit has just gone through a huge rebrand. They are no longer ConvertKit, they are now Seva. They wanted a name that they felt represented their company's mission better. So it is now Seva, which stands for Selfless Service. Now along with this name change came a ton of new features, one of which I am so happy about and that's what I'm going to tell you about in today's video. This was actually my biggest issue with Squarespace and now it's solved, so as you can imagine, I'm pretty happy about it. What it does is it completely eliminates the need for a third party app in order to connect Squarespace and ConvertKit or Seva. And if you haven't, make sure that you subscribe. I put out new videos every single week to help you grow your online business. So you're probably thinking, what on earth am I talking about? So basically what you want is when someone purchases a product from you, whether you're using Squarespace or you're using Teachable like I am here for my online course, when you do that, you want that information to go over to your email marketing system. So as you guys know, I use and love Seva. It's weird to call it that now. So the reason you want this is so that you can tag those people in your email marketing system properly. And then that means that they're going to get the correct email so you could follow up with them and you can ensure that they're not going to receive any more sales emails if you had them in an email sequence. So up until this point, I had to use the program Zapier. So Zapier is really cool and it is a third party app which connects different programs together. So this is the one I'm talking about here. So for example, I have teachable to student tag. So what happens is when somebody purchases my course, then it goes through Zapier and then they were sending the information to Seva. Well, now Seva has built this feature into their platform so you can actually, I can completely turn this zap off. So for any of you guys that are selling products, this is a really great new feature. All right, so to make this happen, you're going to click on automations and then integrations. And here you'll see a list of all the other platforms that they have built this feature in. So whether you're using SAM card or lead pages, whatever it is, this is going to work for you. So as I said, I was so happy because I use Squarespace and love it and tell you guys to use it, but my course is on Teachable, so let me show you that example. So I'm gonna click on Teachable and I do just need to go through a few quick steps to connect it. All right, so you'll just follow the instructions for whatever platform that you're using and that's all that you need to do for this phase, so click Done and it will bring up a little check mark next to it to let you know that it has connected. So now we need to go into rules and recreate the zap that I was using down here. All right, so I'm going to click add rule and now this is the new addition. So it's this part down here where it says purchases a product. So if I click on that, I can now select my provider, so teachable, and it's going to bring up all the programs that I have. So now I can do if somebody purchases website that wows on the regular price, I can add a tag. And from this tag that I've already created, as you can see, I have a lot of different tags. <laughs> you know, you gotta, you gotta keep on top of your email marketing and really organize your list. But I have a tag here for website that wow students. So that's what we want. And I'm going to save that rule. And as you can see, it will be listed on the bottom here and that's it. So simple as that. So now when somebody purchases my course on Teachable, they are automatically going to be tagged website that wow student. And I have it set up where then they receive an email welcoming them to the course. And then they receive an email a week later, checking in on them, making sure that everything is going okay. And the great part about that is you can keep that going. So you can really um, get as advanced as you want with your email marketing because a program like Seva allows you to do all of this while also making it really simple like they just did this feature. 
So same goes with Squarespace. You would just do the exact same thing. You would make sure to connect this integration. So connect it there and then just set your rule. So this is going to make your email marketing so much easier because you can tag people based on their specific purchase, and then you can decide what happens to that email after, whether you want to subscribe them to a sequence or just add them to a tag so you can follow up with them after. Uh, there's so many things that you can do here, and I'll make sure to cover email marketing in some upcoming videos. All right, guys, that's it for this video. I hope that you're excited about this feature. Let me know in the comments how you will be using it. And if you like this video, make sure to let me know by giving it a thumbs up or hitting subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon with another video.